My name is Emmy Lamb. My name is Roscoe. It's Chad Hendren, and I am from Comox. My name is Echo, and I got my first mountain bike eight years ago, so when I was five years old. Got my first mountain bike when I was four in 2008. Got my first mountain bike 2017 when I was three. I got my very first mountain bike in 1998, and it was rigid, hardtail, and it was terrible. <laughs> You'd go down to a rock curl maybe the size of Bone Storm, and then you'd go down. There'd be a rock drop into some Rudy Technical roots, and then there would be two more drops, and then one big gap, and then one more little speed gap. Right after that, it goes into two other jumps to another rock roll. And then there's a little climb, because in my trails, I like that there's like a bunch of like different stuff in them. And then after the climb, there would be another big berm. There'd be a couple berms like in a row following each other. It's a little bit steep, so you can carry good speed, and the suspension just soaks it all up and then off a nice drop, but a fast paced drop. I don't like the slow ones. Fast paced drop into some more loam, into a nice steep shoot section, I'd say. Um, then we'll hit some roots that are technical. They're hard, they're tough, but you just pop and flow over it. Um, throw in some good doubles in there too. Trail doubles, just natural. Must have some really janky roots in and some rocks to make it extra special. Um, Needs to have some flow, absolutely. Just like, just like some solid blue flow would be great. Uh, some gap jumps. I love big drops, so it's gotta have some of those in it. And then you do the drop, and then into the two fun, like, 20 foot gap. And then there'd be another roll to a big, very steep, like chundery spot with a bunch of roots, so it'd be very tech. And then when you get to the bottom, there's a big berm, and then you'd pop out and finish it off with a nice flowy berm section. Favorite trail ever, Truffle Shuffle. Some super rocky slabs, some roots, all the jank, all the gnar in that trail. Super tight, some tight corners, you gotta be on it, focused, um, but it all flows really nicely. Chunder is my favorite trail. It has got some tech, it's got some flow where there is no flow. Um, the faster you go, the smoother it gets. Broadway is this amazing trail that you start with a bit of Chunder, like it's like all very rooty and like little drops that you can roll, but it's super fun and it comes around the corner. There's kind of like an edge beach side, which you go up over along it, and then there's an uphill, quick up, and then you turn, and then there's a little like, it's a quick like shoot that goes down, and then up really quick, so you have to be on the pedals. And there's a few jumps after that, and then you get into some trees, and there's a little, you have to go over this like little jump thing, but I normally roll it. Could you please describe new vanilla for us, please? Okay, well first it starts into a turn to the right, and then into some, I think they're rollers, three rollers, and then the first jump into a berm to get some speed. And then there's a roller, and then a jump. It's either this, or you can make it a hip. And then there's one last big tabletop that can be really hard to clear sometimes. My dad made me crash into it. <laughs> he stopped there. Top, top of Cupcake, you've got some root sections, some corners, some loam, and then it goes into some rocks, some rock doubles that you can hit that are super sick. Um, steep, tight section into like a left-hand corner, into some more tight, steep, rooty sections. And then you're out into the open for a section over a rock roll down into some more corners, down into tight root sections, and then off the little drop, and you're done. 
all those three of my favorite trails that are built by U Rock, the sickest community of people. And everyone, everyone here always takes part in building and helping out in those trails and makes them how amazing they are. And Forbidden and Gravity, everyone in this community is just so involved and so dedicated and they just, they're stoked. They just love it here and I love that. Okay, I would like to thank UROC for building all these awesome trails. Anybody you'd like to thank? Uh, Gravity MTB and UROC. And my parents. <laughs> Sponsored by mom and dad. <laughs> <laughs> it's super amazing to be out there. My mentor and Lauren. Um, wait, is it okay if I like put the name in there? Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, I'd like to also thank Gravity Garage, like Chad and CJ, for helping me out with all this. The mountain bike community in, in Cumberland is absolutely amazing. Huge shout out to UROC, uh, Dougal Brown, all the trail builders, all the volunteers, uh, everybody who puts time in to help maintain these trails and build them. We can't thank you enough and uh, really keep up all the good work and you know we're, we're here to help you guys and support you as much as we possibly can. Thank you.